I'm having a blast out here at Easter Market, and now I am with Pat Rickert of Rickert Farms. Thank you for hanging out and chit-chatting. Oh, my pleasure. So you are all about heirlooms. Explain to us what heirlooms are. Well, I raise about 45 varieties of apples, maybe 30 heirloom varieties. And so older varieties, generally people say 100 years old, wow. 75 years old variety will be an heirloom. And a lot of the heirlooms I have include uh, Northern Spy, Jonathan, Steel Red, Baldwin, Rhode Island Greening, Wealthy, Duchess. Wow. Lodi. Now, what are these apples that we have in front of us? These are actually an Aztec Fuji. Wow. This apple is not an heirloom, but it's, it's one of the uh, newer apples that's very high quality. No, I mean, you can smell. You can smell them. They smell beautiful, and they're just right here, right in front they of us. Up better than just about anything else in storage. So here in June, they're still a real crisp, sweet, flavorful apple. And uh, Baldwin's and Northern Spies hold up good too, but I'm awesome. all sold out of those. So let me ask you this. What's the difference between an heirloom apple and one that you would find at the grocery store? Well, most heirloom apples are a very high quality apple for either eating or processing or what have you, is a certain specialty use. They might not ship as well or they might require extra thinning or have something else that makes them less conductive to large commercial operations. Okay, that makes sense to me. So tell me about some of the other goods that you have out here. Oh yes, this time of year we're just finishing up with apples and just starting with vegetables. Now we have our Michigan radishes and asparagus and Which beets, also look beautiful, I must and say. And green onions and kale and some uh, potatoes and garlic still from storage. Well, awesome. Everything looks amazing, Pat. Thank you for hanging well, out you. with us. No, we're, yeah. Go ahead. And my orchard's about 30 acres on 60 acres. And wow. we open up there on Labor Day or before, awesome. run through Thanksgiving or Christmas. Okay, we this pick is... and pre-picked apples. And That's... unpasteurized cider. Unpasteurized cider as well. That's awesome. And you've got lime. So this is the whole thing about coming out to Eastern Market on a Tuesday, guys. You can find exactly what you need and some things that will be really, really special, like Pat just mentioned, which are heirloom apples, other heirloom vegetables. Everything is super fresh and vibrant and absolutely beautiful. And let's not forget about all of the really cute kids all over the place. There's such an amazing sense of community out here. You can do everything from, like I said, get an heirloom apple. To, to getting, you know, a nice cup of coffee, running into people that you know, saying hi to folks. Let's not forget um, the black garlic that I'm going to pick up. And, of course, your grocery list that you guys gave me as well. So, you know, we're just out here enjoying the Tuesday market when we're usually in the office. So we encourage all of you guys to do that, too. But I'm going to send it back to you guys in studio for now, and I'll get started on your grocery list. <laughs> hey, Tati, before you start on Jason's grocery Bye. list, Bye. You me off. can you hear me? Sorry. Huh? Oh, never Sorry? Mind. Can you yeah, hear me? Absolutely. Yeah. Before you start on Jason's grocery list, he just shot all of his cash yeah. on a new uh, trimmer for the yard. <laughs> so just make sure you get the money up front. That's all I'm oh, saying. Oh, boy. Yeah, just get the I money. I will. Yeah. <laughs> I will. Enjoy your new trimmer, Jason. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm going to be out there uh, getting rid of those weeds and edging up a storm. Thank you, Tati. Hey, you know, you might want to head over to Eastern Market after the show today. Uh, we've got Tuesday's Market. It is open until 3 p.m. It runs every Tuesday starting at 9 a.m. right through September. You know what's really cool there is they've got our banner hanging in the rafters. Yeah, yeah. that's nice. Uh, for more information, uh, visit the website easternmarket.com. There you see it.